welcome back to the channel. So today, actually, Mike and I are both here at work. Um, I got a little bit of decorating I have to do outside, plus some sales here and there. And Mike is, well, he's here now, but he just got back from finally, we got a truck. So we'll be showing you that later. But yeah, today is just gonna be a normal work day of decorating and sales, of course. So stay tuned and we'll kind of show you how the day goes. See you guys later. Okay, so today we are gonna be decorating the front of the store for the holidays. 4th of July and we have a car show coming up next weekend so we're going to be hanging up some American flags. As you guys can tell, my mom does not want to be on camera, but oh, she's going to be on camera. So she's going to be out here helping. This is all something we like to do, guys. It's always a good eye catcher for the store as well. So when we get these huge flags up like this, people driving by just is a great way for people to see the shop. And it gives them a more opportunity to come in and visit us. So... So this is something we do usually every holiday, uh, Christmas, 4th of July, uh, Easter, everything like that. It's just a great way to bring people's eyes to the shop, you know. That's another thing we're working on right there is we got to get the sign repainted. Because that one's been like that since we've owned the place. So we actually got this sign from a gentleman uh, just a town over. We got such a great deal. He handmade the whole sign. So... It was a really good price and he did a really good job. So the only thing the probably is the issue with is that it says unique 66 antiques. So forever people always thought we were unique 66 antiques. And obviously we are 66 unique antiques, but at the end of the day, we always tell everybody that excuse me, we're on a busy highway. So you're gonna see a lot of uh, uh, semis and stuff going by. But yeah, other than that, this is what we do. So we are definitely a family ran organization here because it's usually my mom, Amber, and me out here doing all the stuff that, you know, normally needs to be done for a store. We don't get employees or nothing like that. This is the way we like it. You know, that way there's less, what do they say, less uh, less chefs in the kitchen. And that's what this is, is less chefs in the kitchen. Mine's in the second, wi or the second window. So, yeah. this window, but there's the second one closest to the... <laughs> Sorry. Oh! <laughs> I should have limboed. Yeah. <laughs> have a good weekend, guys. Thank you. Hello. How are you? So, yeah. Yeah, I got you. I'm coming to hold it. So, yeah. This is what we do all day, guys. If we gotta get set up, we're not only owners of this business. We're also employees. We're also the janitor. We're also, you know, we're everything. We're the accountant. We're the lawyer. We're everything. Because that's what you do when you own your own business is you get to do all this stuff. I mean, the best part about it is you get to make, at the end of the day, what it is. You know, so you get to make whatever this wants to be. Whatever your business wants to be, this is what you get to make it. So, so yeah, we'll keep you guys the final product once it's done, but let's, uh, we're going to continue going on with this guy. Okay. All right. Now time for the big reveal. We just got back, uh, from, uh, Richland, Michigan, which is about 50 minutes uh, from our, uh, from our house. Um, and this is the back door entrance to our store. So if you have big items, this is actually how you get it in. Um, so yeah, we parked out back. So let's, uh, do the big reveal of the brand new truck. Oh no, I say brand new. It's not brand new. <laughs> it's a 2001. We were just looking for something that's can give us the ability to haul items and nothing new. We have to worry about getting busted. I, you know, so, you know, it's not bad. It's it's 160,000 miles on it. And Amber parked it back here, I believe. And there she is. 
nice white Ford F-150. Like I said, it's, uh, doesn't always have to, it doesn't look bad though. I don't want to say it doesn't look the best, but it does. It's not a bad, it's not a bad truck. Drives great. New tires on it, the guy said. Like I said, we got a really good deal on it. Got a really good deal on it, and it's going to give us a great vehicle to take to auctions and sales and, you know, help us haul a bunch of stuff because our van just wasn't doing it no more. But uh, this guy is going to be the new, the new face of us buying stuff because we actually have a gentleman that does uh, truck wraps. And so we're debating on getting the, the back of the tailgate done and maybe the back of the windows done. But it's like I said, it's, it's going to serve the purpose of what we need it for, which is hauling stuff. Because you'd be surprised how many times we go out to people's houses, you know. So we need the ability to be able to haul stuff out of there. So, And of course, like we told you guys before, we're remodeling the house. So when you remodel a house too, you also have to pick up boards and uh, siding and all this other stuff. So, so yeah, guys, that's, uh, that is the brand new truck we just picked up. We are very excited for it. It's been a long, long look for this vehicle. So, uh, yeah. So it's been, it's been fun. Uh, today's actually been a, a fairly for a Friday. It's been a little slower, but we also know too that it's been about. It feels like 96 degrees out right now, and these old buildings, like the ones we have here, is just not. They don't, they hold cool air, so the downstairs, the main floor here is not bad. But the upstairs can get a little toasty. So, uh, so you know, we have to deal with that as well, and customers know that too. So usually in the morning, like this morning, we're very busy. Uh, and then it usually dies off right after lunch, and then it'll be a little more sporadic the rest of the day. So, so yeah, I mean, it's one of those days, we kind of know how the summer goes here. We've been here eight years, so we kind of know... Uh, you know, what is going to be our busy times and what's not going to be our busy times. And usually from May until middle of June is not necessarily our busy time because what's going on during that time, you have graduations, you have open houses. So it's one of those things where you're competing with people's time. And as things are starting to open back up around the country, as well as the world, it's time for, you know, people are going to be experiencing more sporting events and concerts and not necessarily, you know, plugging or plugging, uh, visiting antique stores as much as they were when we were some of the only stuff open in the country. So retail wise. Um, so yeah, guys, I mean, that's pretty much been the day today is, uh, you know, a few customers in and out. Uh, doing a little decorating outside, which was fun. And then obviously showing you guys the new truck. So past that, still waiting to find those customers that are okay with me putting them on YouTube. So I do apologize for that. That's something that we are going to get on here. But I also don't feel right just saying, hey, guess what? You're on YouTube and then throwing a camera in their face. <laughs> I always feel like that's like the not the way to go about doing this. So, so yeah, we'll do more sales. And like I said, as this series gets rolling, I'm telling you guys, this is going to be a great series. We're going to do a lot more with what's going on in the store. Uh, next week's episode is actually going to be during the car show. We have a huge car show in town, so we're gonna do. Uh, we're gonna be walking through the car show as well as um, in the store as well. So you're gonna see a lot of people coming through, a lot of customers. It's gonna be a lot of fun. And then we actually have, we should have, collecting 101 videos coming back this week. And then we're gonna have auction adventure videos, which I don't think the next auction for me is till next weekend. So there's gonna be a little bit of, a little bit of lull in those. But I'm telling you, like I said I. Um, I have enjoyed doing all this. It's just getting the time sometimes to make sure I, you know, feel comfortable and feel, you know, right giving you guys the proper content that needs to be out there. So, so yeah, like I said, I don't want to keep talking you guys' ear off. As you can tell, it's, you know, it's kind of slowed down here so I can sit and talk all day because that's something I'm really good at. So, but I won't do that to you guys. I won't pass this video along, but um, I will do an outro to this video at the end, kind of letting you guys know how we go through, shut everything off and whatnot, but um, and then Amber was actually in this video, which was awesome. She's going to start trying to get into a little more videos too, because, uh, she's a total different personality than I am way more talkative, can sit and talk for hours and hours and hours and hours and hours for our customers. And she does as some of you customers might know. So, um, so yeah, like I said, guys, we're gonna, uh, here for another about hour 
and then we'll go through do a shutdown get out of here for the day uh, if anything else really cool happens i'll definitely let you guys know but this is kind of what uh in days when it's just about 100 degrees out it's like inside the shop it's cool down here but I can see why people don't want to get out. They're enjoying the air conditioning at home and air conditioning their vehicles, I'm sure. So, all right, guys, we are going to get through these last hours and we'll uh, talk to you here soon. All right, bye bye. All right, the day is over, guys. We're upstairs turning off the last bit of stuff. Very ho hum Friday, but again, with this kind of weather, guys, it's just, it's just what it is. You know, we just get stuff done here. We get a bunch of stuff put up on eBay uh, that we have up right now. Uh, you know, you try to keep yourself busy doing many other things. And that's just what we did today. We got some, uh, like I said, we got the stuff done outside. Got the new truck. Who is not that look kind of creepy from the... <laughs> it is some steep stairs, but, you know, not, not too bad. Oh, actually, I turned the lights off up here. So yeah, that's our day today. That was Friday. As I said, we had Amber in this morning, me in this afternoon. That's how it goes sometimes. She might work half a day if I'm busy, and then I'll come in if she has something to go do. I mean, it's really a great system we have going on here. So um, we absolutely love it. It gives us time to be at home with our kids as well as being here with our customers that we absolutely enjoy as well. So, so yeah, that's going to be the day today, guys. And then um, tomorrow... What do we have going on tomorrow? I don't know what we got going on tomorrow. It's going to be hot. I think Amber's going to be at the store tomorrow, which is Saturday. Which would be today for you guys, because actually I'm going to post this video today. So, that's another thing I want to show you guys too. This is something we offer at the store as well. We have um, in with the Amish. So, the Amish sends out baked goods every weekend. So, we always have cinnamon rolls, pies, hand pies, cookies. Just a bunch of really cool stuff. So, that's something um, too. When you guys come out here, you always will get, at least if you come out here on the weekends you'll get uh, a chance to buy some Amish baked goods as well. And they do a really good job and it's very delicious. So that's something um, to keep in mind too. So let me turn this camera around here. Hey, there we are. Yeah, and uh, like I said, guys, thank you so much for watching. I know today, again, not a super eventful day, but these antique lives are going to get more and more adventure. Trust me. As we get rolling, get a better format for it. This kind of gives you guys a little rundown of what we like to do every day, um, what we have to do every day. And there's just fun stuff like decorating and, you know, cleaning up booths. Uh, getting the new truck today was my biggest thing because, man, we've been just on the hunt for a big truck for a while. So, again, thank you guys all so much for watching. If you want to like this video, comment below. And then, of course, if you get some time, subscribe to the channel. we got a lot of content coming up, trust me. Uh, getting back into the collecting videos and get going. So uh, just trust me that there's a lot more content coming up. We just have to get through some of this uh, busy time we have going on here. So again, thank you guys so much for watching. We get some time. Come out and see me or Amber and get your antique fix on M66. See you guys later.